everyone, my name is Celine. If you are new to my channel, welcome. So today I'm going to be doing three easy to do and easy to follow hairstyles that are so perfect for the summer as well as back to school if you're watching this going back to school because I know some schools start earlier and some start later than others. Mine starts later. So, so a lot of you have been requesting for me to do many hair tutorials because I haven't really been doing many hair tutorials and before I chop off all my hair I wanted to film in a few hair tutorial videos. So here I am doing three all in one video for your benefits and so all of these incorporate braids so if you do not know how to do a simple braid I would suggest that you learn how to master it or just learn how to do it before watching this video. They're all simple braids, there's no complex French braids or waterfall braids. It's all very easy and very simple to follow like I stated before. One of the hairstyles is what I'm wearing right now so hopefully you guys will enjoy this video. Hopefully you guys will try something out and if you do make sure to tweet me or Instagram me pictures at beautyblush06 which is my username on the social media website. So without any further ado, let's get on to the video. So first what you're gonna do is just brush out your hair so you don't have any tangles and I'm looking into a mirror here by the way that's why it might be a little bit weird if you see me looking off into the distance while doing my hair. So after I brush it out I'm just going to be doing a very simple side braid. However before I start the side braid I'm just going to be um, taking my hair as you can see here and then bringing a little bit below my ear and then making a little hole like so and so I'm going to be making it into two parts basically and then after that I'm just going to be taking an elastic and I'll use a pink one for the sake of this video so you guys can see it um, I'm making a very simple low pony kind of like side pony and then after I do that I'm going to be taking my two fingers and making the hole that I was talking about before and bringing the hole in like the ponytail like taking my finger and pushing it into the hole so it goes through I only got this like twist kind of thing and then after I do that I'm just going to be braiding the rest of my hair downward before I braid you can fishtail this braid or just do any kind of braid you want to do I'm just going to be doing the generic simple three strand braid And then when you get to the very end, you're just going to take a small elastic, and I got a huge pack of elastics, and I'm just going to be tying my hair. And it's okay if you have a bunch of hair strands like at the end. Okay, now that I have this like weird hairdo right now, I'm going to be taking my hair and bringing it forward and kind of doing a side braid like this. And then when I'm done, I'm just going to bobby pin the hair into place so it looks like a side braid kind of twist. And if you want to pull out a few French strands just to finish off the look, you can totally do that. And it is very simple and so easy to do. Okay, this next hairstyle, like I left a lot of space here so you guys can see it, is your not so average messy bun. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to be incorporating a few braids into the messy bun look because you guys have been asking for me to do a perfect messy bun. And so I pretty much wear buns at least once a week during the school and probably at least three or four times a week during the summer when I'm not really seeing anyone. So first what you want to do is make sure your hair is detangled again and you're going to be taking a top section of hair, just a good chunk of hair, like so, as you can see, that's a lot of hair. And you're just going to be starting to braid upwards, kind of, so you can see the braid, so you're not kind of doing it um, blindly, I guess. And so you're just going to be braiding a regular strand of hair. As you can see, it's kind of crazy right now, it's just like a random strand of hair, and it's pulled backward, which is really important because your braid is, um, because your bun is pulled backwards. And I'm going to be taking the other chunk of hair from the front section, again, braiding it backwards. Okay, my braid is far from perfect, but that is absolutely fine because it's not really, it's not really that important as you will see. So then take all of your hair, including the braids, and adjust the braids so it's not going to be very messy. And then make sure that you have, it's almost as though you're going to be making a ponytail, however, make sure everything is even, that there's no random strands sticking out. 
So collect all of your hair together. And then almost as though you're going to be forming a high ponytail, take that piece of hair, the chunk of hair that you're holding, like all of it, and then twist it to the right or your left, whichever one you'd prefer, and then just keep on twisting it. As you can see, it's all twisted. And then bring the twist forward and hold down your hair using your free hand. Hold down the twist that you have and continue to twist it all the way to the ends. And then continue to bring it forward. And then after that, as you can see, you have kind of like a braided bun and then tied off with an elastic. So after you are done with that, then just take the elastic and just tie it off. finished messy bun this is kind of messy kind of organized but by the end of the day your bun will become messy because you'll be up and running and doing other activities and if you want to make it more messy you can certainly pull out a few strands of hair from the front of your head and so basically what you do you take some of your fingers and then just kind of pull a few baby strands out however I don't really have many baby strands my strands are all kind of long so it would look kind of funny on me but if you have many baby strands and you have a lot of layers especially then that would look really great so this next tutorial is going to be super easy because now that I just did the messy bun uh, tutorial, I already have the braids set in because I did not undo those yet. However, now that I don't have my bun, I'm going to be making it like a ponytail. However, I'm going to be putting a twist on it. So keep these braids that you already had done from the top of your head there. And now taking your sh two strands from the side of your head, for, so one from here and one from there, you're going to be bringing it back to form a ponytail kind of. However, you're going to have a couple of braids thrown in there and it's going to be a low bun. So it's going to be super pretty and something just to get all of your hair out of your face. So say you're outside and you're doing a lot of running or just a lot of activities where you're up and going and you don't really want to worry about your hair falling out or anything like that so we're just gonna get right into it so like I said pick up a chunk of hair from the side of your head so this is my chunk of hair it's pretty much the majority of the hair that I have left and then take your hair from the other side and then just braid those two sections And yep, you guessed that you're going to tie off the rest of the braid using elastic, just like we've been doing for this entire video. One braid down, one more to go. Okay, now that you're looking absolutely crazy, you're going to be taking the two braids that you had and again, bringing them to the back of your head like so. And then collect all of your hair, including the braids. And again, start twisting them just like you've been doing for the other braid and for the other buns. It's going to be twist look like this and then taking a hair tie that's hopefully close to your hair color you're just going to be tying it all off. is the finished third look. And that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. I certainly had a lot of fun creating these tutorials for you guys. And again, tweet me or Instagram me pictures if you happen to try these out and comment down below which look was your favorite. And I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And also, just like a side note, not really relevant to the hair thing, but um, I'm not really wearing any makeup today besides any besides lip balm that I have on with some color in it. So that's that. I didn't really feel the need to put on makeup. It's summer. I don't really wear makeup every single day. So that's that. And anyways, I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And again, please comment down below which hairstyle you think you will be trying out for the summer or just whenever you'd like to. And anyways, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, everyone.